Tired of juggling spreadsheets and calendars? Turn your spreadsheets into Outlook schedules using Zapier. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap. In Zapier, a Zap is a simple way to connect different apps and make them work together automatically. I can create my Zap by typing into the search bar, Google Sheets to Outlook. Then I'll click try it. The trigger screen will then pop up. Our trigger is an event that starts any Zap. The first time we set up Google Sheets, we'll need to connect it with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Google account. And don't worry, Zapier will only perform the actions you tell it to in a given Zap. We'll then need to fill out our trigger apps data. To do that, select the spreadsheet and worksheet you'd like to use for your Zap and click continue. In order to finish setting up the trigger, we'll need to pull in some example data. To do that, click test trigger. Testing our steps ensures that the data we entered is working. You're all set with the first step. Click continue and we can start creating our action. In Zapier, an action is a task that happens automatically after our trigger is set off. Log into your Microsoft account just like you did with your Google account in your trigger step. From there, we can start to assign our trigger apps data into the action apps fields. I can select from the drop down menu or add my own text to customize my Zap even further. Once that's complete, I'll test the step. Let's check our Outlook account to make sure this worked. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, whenever we upload data onto a Google Sheet, it'll automatically be uploaded into our Microsoft Outlook account. I hope this was a helpful demo. And if Outlook and Google Sheets aren't your thing, Zapier helps anyone connect apps and automate work. No coding required. You can sign up and start for free.